Louisa? Yes, my darling. It was very nice coming out with you this morning. As usual. Um, we have I, fun. I enjoy all the little lineups we did. <laughs> you like the lineup? I don't particularly like the lineup, but everywhere you go in this world, you have the lineup. Yeah, boy, especially in America. Eh? You go to the embassy, American embassy, you have the lineup. You go into America itself, you line up. Oh, gosh. You but Trinidadians never knew how to line up long time, eh? Oh, Man used what? to be breaking line and thing, but when you see them go to America now, mm -hmm. everybody had a line up. So, but I want to say, you know, I want to apologize to you. For what, boy? I was a little, um, you know, I, I, I kind of reacted a little bit yesterday when I was trying to tell you, you know, Louise, you need to come out of the grass a little bit because, you know, you were, you were recently not well and there you were still plodding away at the weeds and I got a little kind of irritated <laughs> but you know what it did what it did to me is um you know men usually react react yeah and women have a tendency to just kind of you know boil down a bit not all women eh not all women at all not all women brother some women like to quarrel too you know yes but I want to say that I am sorry because when I think about it. Let me see that face if you're really looking like you're sorry. I sorry too bad. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that face I look so sorry, you know. No, 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 no. But I mean time has passed and we have we have um the nice thing about you is that you you are able to um Oh look at that thing. I wanna be on that plane. No, no, I want to be on that plane. Right. Well, remember the airport is We just went to Price Mart. And then we duck in at Arawak to get some chicken and some eggs. And now we are taking a drive to the back to come out in St. Helena. So, it's a nice, it's now midday, last Mr. Sana is cooking chicken foot soup, chicken feet soup. <laughs> you know, we said chicken foot soup, chicken foot soup, but chicken feet soup. So, I don't know whether he did a video, but Lancy and I, we are now driving. There's beautiful clouds ahead, doesn't look like it's going to rain. We had a pattern where we will be very sunny in the morning for the last week and immediately at 12 rain comes. But today it looks like it's gonna be a beautiful bright sunny day in Trinidad at least particularly in the eastern part. We don't know what happened in San Fernando. Wow, there's a cement truck. So, anyway, so to, I, I just want to clarify something. Yes, darling. Sorry because, about that. Sorry yeah, about yeah. that. It's not that I don't want your apology. Well. But I didn't even know we vex. No, we're not vex. It's just a reaction. Okay. Oh, so I didn't see that. Oh, was that when I said to you, you be how you call me, dear? Like a vex? You're right. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. You say, Louise. No, 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 no. I'm not hearing what you say, but I know you're vexed. <laughs> right, so that, that, that is I'm what you're talking about. What do you mean? You don't know where to turn? I don't know what is happening here. <laughs> but you just drive on the road, no man. What is fella trying to do? Reverse? The road is closed, apparently. What? Oh, because of floods. Me and nobody, but if it, if, it, if that is the case and for us have turned back, we want to do the same thing. Well, you must see. Let me see what going on here. You want to turn back too? Obviously, sorry. Obviously, because of the rains, we talk about we talk about people lining up, people line up, they turn up, turn on, turn on wrong too, boy. What going on, Lancy? You talking about lines a while ago? Look, look I really don't know what happened, but I will tell you. Can't say. 
Everybody turn it back, I don't know. Well, well. <laughs> that's right. Sometimes in life, there's a turn around point. A turn around point, brother. You might be going in the wrong direction with your relationship. You gotta turn around. A complete 360 degree turn around, get yes. in place yes. and all that. Yes. 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 So, for funny how you're talking about it, lining up and lining up. And look at how we had to line up to turn back. That's right. So, folks. I have no idea why we have turned back, but you know, <laughs> when you don't get the message clearly, we tend to follow the leader. Yes, indeed. You know? Look at this beautiful mountain, northern range, the man. Yes. Trinidad is a beautiful place, you know. Very beautiful. I mean, I love to travel. Beautiful I people. Trinidad, I love all my people in Trinidad. I love my Trinidad. country, boy. I love my country. I love my country, bad, bad. Love my Ready for a, a parang or what? <laughs> you sound like you're ready for parang. I love my country. So what are we doing? Go back home then? No, no, no. We're not going to go back home because we have to. We have to get into Saint Helena. Okay, right. But Louis, you're not going to love me a chance to explain. Okay, sorry. Something. Sorry, yeah. Sorry. I know you're very happy today, but. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Let me, let me right just explain something. Yes. Now. Okay, okay. Go right Sometimes ahead. in overreacting. Without considering before we speak, it produces a problem. You know? So I again want to say sorry, but I, I, I appreciate your personality that says, you know, okay, darling, you you were a little offended. I know, I know, I don't put any words in your mouth now, yeah? I know I am a. Yeah, I'm talking for you now. I know, darling, that I'm a little slow in listening to you. It's not that it, I despise what you say. It's just that, you know. I like to be spontaneous. Yes. Say that again, let me hear you. I like to be spontaneous. But well, it must not be spontaneous at the expense of others, eh? Well, I don't find if I am pulling out wheels that should be offensive. <laughs> no, but there was something on hand that needed to be done. Oh, Other right. than weeds. Okay. <laughs> right? Okay. Anyway, we're not going back in that direction. But we're talking about the re about reaction, reaction time. About you know, considering before we react. They say it will bring peace, it will nourish your relationship. Of course. You know? Because sometimes by our reaction, we might bring out a worse reaction in your partner. Fortunately, I'm not big enough myself, eh? Fortunately for you for you. Mama Lou let things slide. But that sounds like a lot sliding, right? <laughs> Landslide. <laughs> Landslide. <slide. laughs> no, but um reactions rarely could bring worse reaction on your partner. That's why you don't catch every ball that is thrown at you. You think silence is also a reaction that is troublesome? Have you said something happened between the husband and wife? And right. you lapse into total Deep, absolute silence. They shouldn't be carried on for too long. Should because be that's silent resentment, you know. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I don't believe in giving poor people cold shoulder. No, 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 no. I myself don't. I consider that bad I think manners. Cold shoulder is bad manners. And a lot of people feel that is the way they deal when they're upset. I've heard many people in relationships say, I give him a cold shoulder. Um, I, I guess she, uh, I ain't talking to she for the rest of the week. No, I don't find that is a good style. I, I would much rather talk it out. Right. If, if I, if your behavior is really, as you well know, not acceptable, I will choose an opportune time. Uh -huh. and try to have my tone in order so I can express how I feel without being offensive. Right, right, right. But a lot of times, it, with other people, it may not be so. One person react and the other one give you the cold shoulder, one. Or two, they explore on you in a worse way than you have reacted. 
So we really need to be careful by our action and our reaction. Very true, very true. And you know, there is a saying, take no offense and give no offense. Mm -hmm. I think if we can live by that motto, we will have more peaceful times. Hello, good afternoon. Good day. Mr. 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah. How are you? Who are you, sir? I don't know you well, Paul. Oh. I'm in front of um, my boy, Santa. LP boy. Yeah, yeah. Right. I don't know what's going on my mouse, but I had to go back and take the whole room. Yeah, right. same there. So you are, sir. Same with us. Good night. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's a nice. Yeah. Yes, so Louis, you were saying the reaction is important to find the right time to reconcile. Yes, That's I right. do not believe in people being vexed with each other. For lengthy periods, I can appreciate getting quiet because if you don't stay quiet, sometimes you'll react and behave bad and quarrel and say things you'll regret after. And you know, they say the spoken word cannot be retrieved. Mm -hmm. I try to not, not only to you, but even in my workplace, I try not to react by harsh treatment. Right. And I cannot say that I never knew harsh treatment on a job. Mm -hmm. There were times there have been harsh treatment, but I would stay quiet at the moment. Oh, probably cry. How <laughs> would you believe Mama Lou could cry and laugh in the same house, you know? I think you all know that. <laughs> <laughs> but um, our reaction is very important. But also, we need to be careful how we speak to each other. That's right. Regardless of how bad the situation is, how angry you become, we are not children. We are adults together. Mm. And you cannot talk down to your partner, no matter how angry you are. Because respect is respect. We have to respect each other and ch and choose our timing. Because even if there was a situation that warranting warrant you reacting, remember you are in the presence of your children, you are in the presence of friends, you are in presence of public. So it is not nice to be disrespectful to your partner by saying bad words or speaking loudly to them or <clears throat> cursing us to curse each other. Mm -hmm. I, I think that is total and utter disrespect. Thank you very much, Mom. I appreciate that. And I'm thankful that you have accepted my apology. So now we can move on in peace. Right. So, so what's the topic? So the topic now is, I want to say, we were very happy to meet a young woman and her child. They, we met them at Price Mart, and then I met a young woman from Arima, and um, I didn't get their names correctly, and um, but they they were very friendly, and I want they would know when they watch this video who they are. So once again, thank you very much, and we are heading. Now to St. Helena, we're going to go to Kelly Village. And all the best, have a good week. Keep it up. And Mama Lou, a little word of bye-bye. Yes, particularly I have not hailed out to Faz for quite a while. Faz, I often think about you and enjoy our visit together the last time and your kindnesses. That roti was so delicious. I'm still to go and get some of that roti skin and even have a wrap roti yes and um also susie and allison allison and jen and, and jen hi to you all and all those who we cannot remember because of our uh handicap <laughs> Bad memory. Bad memory. <laughs> but all the best to all who follow us and who who encourage us to stay stay the journey. Thanks again and have a good week. Be very careful out there. Watch the weather. Just to the post. To the post. We just and the wrong this um the wrong about to head to Kelly. Mm -hmm. 
Line up again, Lancy. Line up again. That because all that traffic turned back from mm -hmm. on the other side. Yeah, the reason we are talking about line up is I hope to also um, be able to read uh, maybe this afternoon, maybe this <laughs> evening, tonight, tomorrow, a little <laughs> short story that I did and go back to those those segments of storytelling. So thank you very much and we are out. Bye. Chicken foot soup for the people with the virus. <laughs>